Clean everybody. Boy, Bonnie, that was a super presentation. You know, people asked me the other day, somebody said, uh, are you going to endorse Bonnie as mayor? I said, I don't have to. Nobody else has to. She has earned being re-elected as mayor. That is so important. Well, you know, I, I just want to say it was just great to sit there and hear about all the great progress that we've made. And uh, Bonnie and her council has carried on in a very, very special and very dynamic way. And I'll tell you, with the challenges that are being faced today, it's not an easy job, no question about it. But I'm so delighted when I see companies moving into Mississauga because that's what we need, jobs, and of course the companies keep our taxes down. We are so fortunate in this great city. And I want to tell you, I'm not supposed to speak a long time because Bonnie has covered it all beautifully. But I want to tell you, when I picked up the Golden Mail on the 16th, of September and read their editorial, I'll tell you, I was very proud. They recommended that Mr. Bernier, who has left the Conservative Party because of his concern, I say, for immigration, etc., they said he should go out to Mississauga. And see how the people from all over the world live in harmony. No problem. Well respected and such. Because I didn't talk much about diversity. I talked about unity. Yeah. Unity of all the culture and of all the people that have come to Mississauga. Karasaga started some 40 years ago when we brought representatives of some of the people from around the world that were in Mississauga. And I believe last year there were 72 nations in the Karasaga. It's working together, that is, unity of all people that have chosen Mississauga as their home. But Madam Mayor, I want to thank you. I want to thank you for your contribution. I, 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 you know, I've tried, I have, I always said when I would retire that I did not want to be a backseat driver. <laughs> I wanted to encourage and to look forward to what the mayor and members of council would be doing to further this great city of Mississauga. But, for us to remain safe, and we have been the safest city for some 20 years, it's up to you. It's not up to the police. Police solve crime. Citizens prevent crime. So I know the mayor would him. Really, that's up to us. Each and every community in Mississauga should make it their responsibility to make sure that no crime is found in that community, appears in that community. And it's up to us to do that. Madam Mayor, congratulations. I wish you every success. And I hope that the people will choose widely, wisely, I should say, when they elect the councillors to work with the mayor. Yeah. That is very important that they work with the mayor because it's it is the team that I was the I was able to build that brought Mississauga to this point in its development. It needs a team spirit. And in order for there to be a team spirit at City Hall, it's up to the people that elect councillors that are prepared to work 
and with the mayor and the staff of the city to continue our success. Mrs. Saugan, as I've often said and will repeat as long as I'm on this earth, Mrs. Saugan is the best city in Canada.